Martin Luther King Jr. said, everybody can be great because anybody can serve. And Margaret Mead proffered, never doubt that a small group of thoughtful, committed citizens can change the world. Indeed, it is the only thing that ever has. Stand Up Blue Springs is an engine that drives community engagement. And at its core is the commitment of more than 400 volunteers whose efforts focus on children's dental health and healthy lifestyles promotion. Together, volunteers serve thousands of children and families in eastern Jackson County each year. Stand Up Today is the result of a merger of Blue Springs Well Link and Stand Up Blue Springs, two local nonprofits that shared a common vision to enhance the quality of life for local citizens. Before we imagine our future, let us look back at our roots. In 2002, representatives of several Blue Springs organizations were invited to form a grassroots group committed to the health, safety, and well-being of the community. This group became Blue Springs Well Link. Its first project was the Wellness Resource Directory, a project suggested by citizens involved in Out of the Blue into the Future. 15,000 directories have been printed and distributed. The directory is now in its third edition online. Its next project responded to the national and local dental health crisis to provide children in need with essential care. In 2003, the Dental for Kids program saw its first client establishing the successful pathway for hundreds of children to be matched with local dentists to receive free dental care. Later, low-cost orthodontic care was added. Plenty of kids here who have uh, poor dental care and thought that it would be a great, uh, great way to give back to the community that was in. So. Uh, we, we, we started it with just a few doctors and it's built up to something that's uh, able to run on its own now. So. Dental for Kids is important for me and my children because being a parent who hasn't been able to give my kids to the dentist on a regular basis, they have provided that extra support and helped me get my kids to the dentist. And she had uh, six cavities, uh, two of which were, were quite deep and uh, if we had not gotten her in when we did, she would have been looking at uh, an extraction or root canal on two of the six teeth within probably 12 months. So uh, we uh, cleaned her teeth and uh, did fillings over the course of three appointments. Shakira had um, a tooth that was chipped and they fixed that for her. And so she says, I can smile now. <laughs> she doesn't cover her smile anymore. <laughs> In 2005, Stand Up Blue Springs was founded by Carol Jernigan and Dave Wright, who were joined by other local volunteers to host citizen summits. Two major successes from these summits were the Off-Leash Dog Park and Disc Golf Park, public amenities operated by the City of Blue Springs that were brought forth by citizens who leveraged volunteers and funding resources through community collaboration. Sharing a common vision, WellLink and Stand Up merged in 2007, retaining the name Stand Up Blue Springs. Dental for Kids remained the flagship program for the organization. Sparkle Smile Academy was added to provide dental education for children in eastern Jackson County. Each year, more than 2,000 children attend Sparkle Smile Academy to meet Princess Alligator and Sir Brush a lot and receive free smile kits of dental supplies. In 2009, Stand Up continues supporting healthy lifestyles by assuming management of the Meet Me For A Mile program, which provides support for wellness and physical activity. Awareness for new lifestyle, new behavior patterns. Um, instead of Meet Me For A Donut or Meet Me For Coffee, it's Meet Me For A Mile. And anyone can do a mile. In 2010, Blue Springs Mayor Carson Ross approached Stand Up to facilitate the local Let's Move initiative. Stand Up continued a successful Citizen Summits in 2011, convening residents to brainstorm projects to enhance and expand programs focused on healthy eating and active living. So who better to do it than a group of people that has community visioning anyway and is very successful in what they do, and that will Stand Up Blue Springs. From a community perspective, the whole intent is to create generations of healthier citizens. And I have to tell you, I grew up a fat kid. And I hate putting this on tape, but the truth of the matter is I did. I was 250 pounds plus when I graduated from high school. And I know what that does to somebody growing up as a fat kid. And I know it affects their health. I know it affects their self-image. I know it affects their self-worth and can lead to lots of other bad conditions and bad situations throughout a person's lifetime. 
And my intent with this, and the reason that I'm so passionate about this and wanted to be involved in this was because I think we can keep other kids from having to face what I faced as I was growing up. This particular project, the Let's Move Initiative, truly has, in my opinion, some of the best possible ways that we can make a huge difference in this community. And I believe that this program and the different initiatives that we're going to bring about through Let's Move and through Stand Up Blue Springs can make those changes positively here in Blue Springs. Stand Up's significant efforts in Blue Springs and surrounding communities are funded by individuals, companies, grants, and annual fundraiser, The Prince's Party, which features the Tooth Fairy and has grown to be a popular destination event for more than a thousand little girls and their families every October in Blue Springs. Stand Up Blue Springs received a Missouri Municipal League Innovation Award in 2006 in recognition of its community engagement activities. Devoted volunteers wrote the history of Blue Springs Well Link and Stand Up Blue Springs. It has been a decade of dreams fulfilled with a future limited only by our imagination. You may say I'm a dreamer, but I'm not.